It's a mad scramble against the Red Ravens. Coffeeville jumps out to a 10-zip lead. Second quarter facing a first and 10 at the two-yard line. Joshua Pierre-Lewis with the spark for the home team picks it off. And then four plays later, Hunter Watson to Lewis Brooks. Number 14, 14 yards in big blue is on the board. Not even three minutes later, Seville's next possession. Lev Lubin takes it away on the 15-yard line. Three plays later, Watson finds Latrell Bonner from 11 yards out. 14-10 Iowa Western at the break. Good crowd sees the Red Ravens retake the lead early in the third quarter. Joseph Young falls in from 13 yards out. 17-14 Coffeeville. The Reavers have been here before. The home team drives 64 yards in 10 plays in the fourth. Trevor Burnett busts loose for 29 yards to the visitors 12. And then Sean Gary Jr. does the honors. Tight ropes the final 10 yards, and it's 2017 Big Blue, just over seven minutes left. But Scott Strohmeyer and Iowa Western sweat out the Red Ravens' last shot. Third and 14. 28 yards to the Reaver 26, and then on the fourth and five from the 10-yard line, it's incomplete. Stroh and Big Blue hold off Coffeeville 20 to 17. <laughs> they came in for it. Their, their theme was play spoiler, and I knew we were going to get their best. They've played better throughout the year, and uh, you know the, you, they limit your possessions, so you got to you got to score when you get the get the ball. We had to fight back, and we had to find a way to score. So we dug down deep, and we we made it happen. We wanted to make a big play for my team. Every game from now is a playoff game, so I'm going from here on, and just every play is the, the biggest one. This team was a run first team, but I knew that they take shots sometimes. And I told everyone that if I had an opportunity to get one, I'd definitely take it. They came out first quarter, punched in the mouth. We got the momentum, and then the game, we just we just dominated. We did what we needed to do. What else can you ask for? You know, and it's not just I Western and Hutch. It's the junior college uh, community. Everybody's waiting for this matchup. What we gotta understand in situation. It's a situation where it's number two versus number one. Iowa Western at Hutchinson. Nothing more needs to be said. Those are crucial situations, okay?